It's Thursday, so let's eat. The locals living near Lake Russell know this place. It's popular for fishermen and for visitors. 7 News' is Christine Scarpelli is at Regina's Savannah Grill in Calhoun Falls. That's right, just a little bit of a trip for some of you, maybe, but Calhoun Falls is not sleeping, especially for breakfast. We've got Regina here, Regina Savannah Grill, and we've got more to show you. Take a look. We were sent here by locals. They say it's a great place to get a glass of sweet tea and a home-cooked meal. This is the hometown of the owner, Regina, and boy, her food looks fantastic. Let's take a look. Why not go back home? So that's what we did, and we moved back here. We've been here seven years. Best decision ever. Business is like triple. Now Regina's Savannah Grill. It all started in 1995, just over the bridge in Georgia. Regina McLeod cooked for the bait and tackle stop she and her husband owned for travelers and Lake Russell fishermen. It's called a swap fillet, and what we do is we batter it ourselves in a pre-seasoned batter, and that's what it's going to look like. Very good. It's a white fish, and while not from the nearby Savannah River, the batter is packed with flavor. I'm going to take it over here and drop it in the deep fryer, and our fish plates are served with hush puppies and fries. Another favorite, locals line up for the half-pound burger. We roll it out ourselves so it stays together better. We put this up here and get that cooked. McLevler says all the way is the best way. Lettuce, tomato, mayonnaise, mustard, ketchup, and onions. And don't miss out on their famous coleslaw. Mayonnaise and sugar. The phones are ringing all morning here with folks asking for the special of the day. Cook Sean Cutter helps prepare meatloaf. It's got hamburger meat. It's got some brown seasoning. We usually put about four or five biscuits in it. Meatloaf heads into the oven for an hour. We chop our cabbage, cutting up potatoes, and then we'll rinse them and put them on the bowl. I am mashing up the potatoes, and like I said, we don't use a mixer. I like chunky so you know they're homemade. Milk, mayonnaise, butter, salt, and pepper. And that's it. This gravy, we actually mix a little bit of brown gravy and our homemade gravy together. It's meaty, it's got the ketchup touch to it, it's real juicy, it's not dry, and it just goes good with your cabbage and cream potatoes. Whether you're coming from motorcycle riding, fishing nearby, or it's just Tuesday and you need lunch, Regina's gonna cook your meal with time. I love that at Regina's Savannah Grill in Cabin Falls, we all say, let's, let's eat. eat. Gosh, that food was good, especially the fish. That was my favorite. Somebody else's favorite, too, right? That's right. Who do we have here, Regina? This is Raylan. This is one of my granddaughters. And this is two of our good friends, and they call me Nina, too. So they're just like my granddaughter. I think I need and to be adopted. Right. I think I'd like to be a part of this family. <laughs> What's your favorite here? What's your think favorite? About think about it. You have a favorite dish here? Yeah. What is it? Grilled cheese with a little chicken. With two slices of bacon. Grilled cheese and bacon. Who would have put that combination together? That is a good idea. Okay, Monday through Saturday, don't sleep on dinner on Thursday, Friday, and Saturday as well. You're open pretty early in the morning. When would you? 6 6 30. 6 30 in the morning. I love that. And then come get before or after your fishing trip. You'll That's have right. a meal ready for them. All right, here from Calhoun Falls, guys, we'll send it back to you. Enjoy. Thanks, Christine. 7 News will be right back with Pop Topics after this quick break.